you look at Saturday Night Lights, we need to do the prevention. Because if they can bounce the ball on the basketball court, they can wear a black robe on the Supreme Court. Free Wi-Fi and free phone service for those who need it the most. This is a campaign promise made, campaign promise kept. That's what this moment is about. Bring us together as a unit and hear from each other to resolve the issues that we're facing. So I cannot say enough. Thank you for coming out. You are the majority in this city. We're taking the dream of a livable, sustainable, and beautiful city and turning it into a reality block by block. Today we're sending a message. These short-term illegal rentals have a major impact on our hospitality industry and those who are employed in the industry. You're giving folks the counseling they need, you're giving them the resources they need, and a long-term medical and mental care that they deserve. And that's what we're getting right here in this location. The heart and soul of the city is in our cultural institutions. Staten Island cultural groups asked for our support, and what was interesting, we heard them. You have been ignored, you have been denied, you have been abandoned. That stopped January 1st, 2022, when I became the mayor of the city of New York. Welcome on board to this new concept of New York City Ferry Forward, the Adams administration vision on how to utilize our waterway. And at the heart of this program is making sure that the system is equitable. This is why uh, we tell folks to join, you know, the FDNY, your symbol of what it means. And so it just really means a lot when we can pause for a moment and just say thank you for your heroic actions. Thank you.